How do you accept people to come in? Because um, mine's trying to come in. Ah, see, green. Yeah. I'll start doing that. There's one. Well, if you go into participants, that might be the way, and then they'll come up here. See, Claire's in the waiting room. Why isn't mine coming up? Oh, it's my little one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Admin. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
they're pretty ugly actually. I don't like them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Just got their television on. Hey, John Carl's nursery. <laughs> uh, okay, we're going to meet you all. Yeah. Oh, Jackie. <laughs> you, Jackie. <laughs> oh, no, we didn't meet her. Okay. Yeah, we did. <laughs> Your TV is in everything. Suckers. Oh, man, I still got to hear you. Of course, back there with. Cool. Oh, nice. It's really quiet. Oh, yeah. so quiet well, without you guys. Okay, guys, welcome to our nutrition challenge. I'm going to share a screen with you and go through some slides and that. Um, why did everyone just move? Um, I'm just working out how to do this kind of stuff. Is everything right? All right. Do I just click on this one here? Sorry, guys, I'm learning how to use this. Here. Yep, and then that, uh, that one. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So uh, I can't even see if everyone can see that. Yeah, I can see it. Oh, who's that talk? Oh, I didn't <laughs> even know that anyone could talk. Um, so yep. we're going to now welcome you to Infuse Twenty Eight Day Challenge. This is our info session. Um, that we're going to go through it all, what's going to be entitled, what you're going to have in it, um, and everything, so on. So at the end, we will do questions. No point trying to unmute you, mute you guys, and all that kind of stuff. We're better off leaving the questions to the very last minute, um, and then we can go through and ask that. So I am going to jump on. Every right, guys. That's the goal. Okay, so, okay, first one is, why is nutrition so important? It helps maintain your support system. It's going to give you more energy, decrease mental health, reduce the risk of health problems, helps us focus more, and also helps your body to function as well. Um, so this is the reason why we're trying to now implement nutrition into the whole uh, infused, um, because a lot of these guys... Um, may not be getting the results that you guys were after when you first started up. So now adding the nutrition is going to help you guys to get your results. HSN, we have decided to go with HSN as a support group um, because it's been proven with results, easy to simple and aligns with Gaz and I's uh, values that we go through. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, guys. HSN. Why Gaz is going to go through and tell you guys a little bit more why he actually chose the HSN. Hey guys, Gaz here. So yeah, we looked at a few different companies and HSN is probably the biggest one out there. It's very cross related as well. And as you guys know, we believe in a methodology so much and it, it really just follows our nutrition values. So, you know, we've always promoted clean eating. Um, yeah, really no fads about it. And just getting a right amount of uh, macronutrients like your protein, carbs, your fats, and that's what HSN does. They make it simple to follow, and they don't restrict anything as well. So that's the cool thing about it. They actually reinforce positive behaviors. Um, so instead of saying, don't eat this, don't eat that, they say, start adding this to, to your nutrition um, and slowly building up, just building those good habits. And yeah, I guess we mean, well, Beck and I looked at it, and it's something we, doing the training ourselves it's pretty much almost exactly to what we follow ourselves so it's pretty scary um but i guess that's a crossfit behind it um but yeah the cool thing about it is it's just changing your your view on nutrition and food like a lot of people think you've got to starve yourself which is like the contrary you don't have to starve yourself it's just adding those good 
nutritious meals and um and then just building those yeah building those habits one at a time and that's what hsn do they've got heaps of material heaps of support have you told them about, about the app no i haven't got through um, the app at that yeah um, we'll go through the app a bit later but it, it looks super simple to follow um it's yeah pretty pleasing on eyes as well and it just makes us as coaches uh nutrition coaches job much easier to kind of like keep an eye on everyone and help out and support and that's all it is accountant accountant uh accountability and support so that's a bit of a background about hsn app you'll probably see it more um also i'd like to add that with hsn me going through the whole training module as most of you guys know i have lost a lot of weight a lot of their stuff that they're trying to teach you guys um or oh, what we are actually going to be teaching you guys is exactly what I did in my own weight loss journey. So it's going to make things a lot easier for myself to start implementing them. The last thing I want to do is go against my whole beliefs and all that kind of stuff. Um, with the app, it's so easy to use um, as well. You can interact with each other. So anyone else that's on the challenge, you can interact with one another. We can see how everyone's going, like put up things like going, what did you guys have for dinner? All sorts of different things. So having a group chat. So you guys will be in it all together. Yeah, I don't know if you guys know about my fitness pal. This this is something that I track though, but you can actually log your food and we can see what you're eating and it's just super simple to follow. Um, and it's yeah, next level really. So yeah. I don't know. Uh, okay. So what is included in the whole 28 days? Um, you're going to be getting a meal plan, a grocery list, 24-7 support and accountability. We also are giving you access to the private HSN app and access to the private HSN group. We also are going to be doing nutrition uh, kickoff seminars, fun weekly challenges, weekly seminars, nutrition tips, videos, and also a lot of your check-ins are going to be virtual. So um, it makes things a lot easier for yourself and myself. You don't have to come down to the gym. Um, I'll be doing your check-ins all through Sky, uh, Zoom, um, which makes things a lot easier so I can see how everything's going um, and having a conversation with you guys, saves you guys coming down to the box and being down here in front of everyone. So you can do it in the comfort of your own home. Um, is there anything more that you want to add with the whole what's included? Um, and not particularly, yeah. Yeah, that, we're going to go into depth a little bit more. Okay, yeah. so your weekly seminars, what we've decided to do is going to be giving you guys your kickoff seminar and your meal prep basic. So then before you guys actually really start the whole 28 days, you're understanding how meal prep work, works. So then you can get the full results out of it. Family and nutrition, as most of you guys are, are all families, you, last thing that you guys want to be cooking is your own meal, the kids meal, your husband's meal, whatever it is. So now we're trying to make things that little bit easier for you guys, a healthy swap, how to swap your unhealthy meal to a healthy meal, but still having it, um, you know, still tasty. Um, navigating your way out, nights out is a big one, especially the fact that we're coming into Christmas. These guys are gonna be wanting to go out because you're gonna be having Christmas parties um, and all that kind of stuff. So it's helping these guys to go out, but still be able to get the results that these guys are wanting to achieve in the um, challenge and also beyond the challenge as well. Um, the prices for the challenge are $49 a week for your first four weeks. Um, you can pay it either weekly, fortnightly, or your payment up front. It's totally up to you guys how you want to do it. Um, also, after this as well, we also are going to be continuing on with nutrition coaching because as you guys are aware, it's not going to take 28 days to get the whole challenge. This is uh, to get your full results. This is more just giving you guys a kickstart into it. You're going to need that ongoing coaching as well. Um, so the prices are $62 a week for your members. Remember that this is an additional cost to your membership that you already have. It's not included in the CrossFit um, class, a class as well. Um, so yeah, it's just more, uh, it's yeah, just a little bit separate, sorry. Um, 
anything more that you want to add to no, that? Yeah, yeah, we've got different, uh, there's different. Oh yeah, packages. with the packages afterwards. So the $62 a week is just um, the rough I Well, we've got two different packages. You've got a gold package, a silver package, and a bronze platinum package. So just a little bit more stuff into it um, and all that. We'll, can go into depth with that near the end of the challenge. But of course, you're going to be needing that additional support afterwards. Okay. Um, also, we've decided to come up with some awesome prizes that you guys can win. Um, at the end of it, there's going to be a couple's night retreat and a massage, which is valued at over $500. And also every single week, we're going to be um, putting these guys into a draw to be winning weekly weekly prizes, um, which is making sure that you guys are achieving everything that you need to be able to go into the draw. Um, when we do your kickoff seminar, we'll go into details with what we're looking for you guys to be eligible for the weekly prize. Also, what we're wanting you guys to do to also be eligible for the major prize yeah um I, I guess i'll just add on that as well everybody has different nutrition goals so it doesn't when we say nutrition it doesn't have to be weight loss if you want to do it for maintenance or you just want to live a healthy lifestyle if you want to improve athletic performance this hsn covers it all so the main prize isn't going to go to necessarily going to go to someone that's lost the most weight it's more pretty much doing your best at the program and checking into all the meetings and that's how we're going to do the prize because yeah, everybody has different goals. I think that's it. Yeah. I thought there was one more. I don't know. I thought there was one more. Yeah. Sorry, Same. guys. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so you can stop sharing screen now. And just... How do you... Yeah. Okay. So how do I unmute everyone? Well, I think... Let... Okay. Um, I'm going to get you guys to unmute you guys one by one. Um, <laughs> please do not go and unmute you guys um, all at once because um, it will just become too much at once. Um, if there's any questions that you'd like to ask us, feel free to ask us. Who wants to go first? The big mouth. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, I me, me, sorry, Lane. You can go first, Lane. Who wants to go first, Do you, Lane? Yeah, well, yeah. I guess it's just a matter of um, you giving us the program and the, and the meals, and we basically just go through it. For the 28 days and then go from there is that right did you get that sorry someone's tv is in the background and we're struggling to hear what you're trying to say so it's a 28 day program yep so we go on it for the 28 days and what we get our results at the end of that 28 days and then if we want to continue on, then we just go through them, like just keep going through. Yeah, go through yeah. nutrition coaching. So with the challenge, it will be slightly different to the one-on-one -on -one coaching um, because we're going to be spending that, you know, we're still going to be spending time through the challenge, um, but it's going to be a little bit different and how, how it's all done. Mm. Okay, so basically the 28 days is just a starter pack, getting you started and then and see how you go and, yeah. and whether it's right for it. Yeah. Um, just to give you handy tips, videos. It's cool, the apps, you can pretty much do everything from that, send it to everybody. Um, and you can <laughs> log your, your food and we can keep it in. Okay, so in that 28 days, you give us meal, like, you give us what do you do is it shopping so there's a shopping list which is more shopping list um, yeah and meals and um a meal plan that you guys can use yeah. a guide is totally 
like what they say in our videos is totally up to you if you're wanting to use it you don't have to use it it's not about changing anything well you need to have a change of course but we're not trying to change too much at once we're wanting to add things in so a lot of people don't have vegetables or fruit in their diet so we're now wanting to start to add vegetables and fruit into people's diet instead of saying to you guys okay that's it no more takeaway because it's that's not going to happen so yes you can still have these kind of stuff but making sure that you're adding your fruit and your vegetables in and making sure you're hitting your protein carbs fat as well um so it's more yeah, it's just a list yeah. just yeah. a list of foods the best foods yeah. for, that you should be eating yeah fruit yeah. and veg yeah 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 um so kind of what we we go through with what we've had that before that low gi medium gi high gi yeah kind of. we go through that um, um so it's kind of like just tells you what the best options are instead of this yeah but yeah the i think as well is it will give you recipes and it's got this generic grocery list and it just makes it simple like you can exactly need to buy for the week. Um, with the first kickoff seminar, we're going to do the meal prep, so that's going to help out. Also, on the app that you have itself, there is more recipes. So, yes, we might give you something that it may say, okay, for breakfast, I'm just using a rough idea, overnight oats, um, eggs on toast. But if you're going, do you know what? I don't feel like this go onto the app, go into recipes and you can go and find something that you decide to have. You don't have to have what we've given you. These are just more ideas of how to change things. And there's some pretty cool things I've implemented is like eating your, your starches first um, or your, 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 veg, sorry, your veggies first. Um, but I'll do the frozen veggies now and I'll have that first and their view is don't eliminate stuff. Just have the frozen veggies first, then start keeping what you're going to eat. And it's like, you, you kind of feel because you've had the most nutritious things first. Um, just cool things like that. Heaps of really cool advice. And um, Guys, so with the seminars, will you guys record it? Because that first weekend I'm actually away, so I won't be able to, I'm actually going down the bush. So I won't be able to, to be on the video. So if I can maybe watch it on the Monday or will you guys record the seminar? Yeah. We'll record it. Yep, we'll so definitely record it. We're going to do a mixture of like what we've done tonight. So behind us, we've got some of the guys um, and then also do it on Zoom as well and record it. Um, so then if these guys can't make it, then, you know, it is what it is. But to go into the weekly prizes, um, you have to be watching the videos and the seminars. So once you guys have watched it, if you're not viewing it on the night or the day, I should say, we will ask you a few questions just to be making sure that you've watched it to be eligible for the prizes. Yeah. So that's not an issue. Cool. Um, and then with the app, so this app, is this the app that you're talking about? Is that the MyFitnessPal or is that a separate app from H to H um, H is in. That's separate. Separate. That's separate. Uh, and would we have access to that after the four weeks, or does that after the four weeks that ends then? No, no access after the four weeks of the HSN app. But you can have the My Fitness Pal app if you want after the four weeks. Yeah, no, I've got that one. It's just oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Um, I think we've got to add as well that you get the, so prior to the kickoff seminar, you get a twenty-minute uh, talk with Becca, and we'll have like a sheet to fill in just to see where you're at just to yeah that's cool. yeah initial consult with myself um just to see you know what your goals are also what we can look at you know where i can look at helping these guys to be able to get your best results and all that kind of stuff because you know i don't want to sit there going okay everyone's here let's go put you on exactly the same plans because like what we said before all of these guys are wanting different um different goals we're not <laughs> you know some of us could be here just to maintain our weight some of us could be here because we want to lose a little bit of weight some people could be here because they want to gain a little bit of more muscle more weight other people could be because they've got you know comps coming up that they want to be in the best form for the comp so there's all different reasons for why we're needing it and just to help these guys in all those different areas right. Is she gone quiet? Or she got. Oh. She muted herself. <laughs> she muted herself. <laughs> so I was like, uh, is so that all done? Yeah, my dog's barking, so that's why I put it on mute. Oh. Everyone, somebody else can ask a question now. <laughs> 
So uh, do we do we actually just meet individually before we start the, the 28 days so and then we sort of go into the program however yeah whatever's sort of suitable for us the first one will be um face to face being the fact that i'm going to be needing to take your measurements doing body scan also yeah. um, looking at doing at least some photos um so then we've got before and after um so that one has to be face to face then after that your weekly check-ins can be all done through zoom then at the end of once we've booked you uh, your first session we'll book in your last check-in um one to doing all your final measurements and then we'll do another face-to-face -face with your last one so i mean any of them can be face-to-face -face, but it just makes things a lot easier like if you were to say to me look eight o'clock tonight can we do a check-in it's like okay cool i can do it at the comfort of my own home as well as you guys can um and it doesn't need to disrupt any kids or anything like that yeah okay um I do want to check your thing. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. so weigh-ins will definitely be first one. Um, and also weigh-ins at the end. Yeah. Any other questions? Why are the boys so quiet? <laughs> Boys doesn't have problems. Yeah. There's five boys on here. Yeah, yeah we're pretty excited. We're really excited about it. We've done quite a lot of training with this um, to get it up and running. We've got probably another call. It's been like five the training. But it's cool. It's going to it just change your, your relationship with food. Um, and it's changed the way I've come. Yeah, it changed my, my own way that I've looked at things as well. Um, you know, as you guys may have seen some of my stories, I'm also trying to help you guys to make sure that you guys can help make your meals quick and easy um, because the last thing that you want to do is trying to make lunch and you're spending 20 minutes in the kitchen. Making dinner, you're spending an hour. So here's me just trying to give you guys those ideas and also give you guys ideas of what, I eat in a day as well. Gaz will be going through showing these guys what he eats in a day. We're just like a normal person. We eat the, everything um, like these guys would. Um, but yeah, just going through, it's made me realize that I need to eat veggies first before I decide to eat um, too much crap, pretty much. And it's made me put myself back into line. So yeah, it's been good for myself and Gaz, just putting us back to where we need to be. Yeah, we can definitely go through. Um, so guys just asked about, you know, what you guys should be eating before and after a meal. Every person is going to be different. Generally, I'm going to say here, myself, I don't eat before I train because I find that I feel sick. Some people do. For example, I know a lot of people have a banana before they come and train. Um, also toast or whatever, but we can go into details and all that. And we can do that in your first kickstart seminar, um, you know, about what to eat and when to try and eat things to best um, nutrition your body at the right times. Yeah, and there's stuff like, uh, uh, one thing I find out I was pretty surprised about actually, is eating something like fat directly after workout can actually slow your protein intake. So it's things like that, that HSN went over like, which we'll, we'll, we'll cover that, like, don't think about this too much to share, but it's like just taking your, your performance to the next level because I've always been of the belief that you need your right to have protein, carbs, and fats directly after workout. But it's like a small thing like that, or getting like uh, fast carbs into your body after workout to get more protein into you. So, but you know, it's, it's their fair play performance as well. Like God has asked, but but that's why we're going to do that. Um, you know, do the initial meeting to see what you want. Yeah. Uh, guys, just quickly, like you guys said yesterday about the protein shake just the, directly after training. So like when I train at night, so when I finish training tonight, I basically came home and I ate my dinner straight away. But now, so obviously you say, no, you need to do your protein shake first. But then when do I have my dinner then? Ideally, can, if you can get protein to your body straight after a workout, that's still okay. 
Um, there's no, I mean, there's but no then in that. saying that, having your dinner is fine yeah. because when you're having your dinner, you should be having protein anyways, mm. and you're going to be yeah. getting your meats anyways, or yeah. you can have a protein shake with a little bit of um, your meat, um, and then also yeah. carbs. Yeah. Just be mindful of your, like what Gaz said, just be mindful of your fats that you're going to be having with dinner. Um, you know, unfortunately, you're going to have to have some fats being the fact that it's dinner. Yeah. But, you know, that's going to be, yeah, no, Uh-oh. it's not uh, in the mornings. It's not a problem because, you know, I have my protein shake and that's my breakfast because I put my berries and my stuff in it. But it's just when I train at night, it makes it a bit harder to have oh. the protein shake and then have dinner. You know, it's a bit, I mean, yeah. The protein shake's just there to get it fast into your body. You, you, if you can get it from Whole Foods, you can, but it's just how quick you can get it into your body. I have I have pre workout before workout. Reason being, gives me a little kick. Plus, it's got protein in it. So I'm of the belief of well, there's no real right or wrong here, but I'm of the belief I like it running through my my blood while I'm working out, repairing my muscle tissues, and then I'll have a protein shake afterwards just to make sure I've got enough protein. Mm. But I think someone was in uh, just recently and they went through a bag within like a week and a half, and he was having like two and a half scoops three times a day, and it's like that's just too much, you know. It's, Way too. Yes, um, I worked with someone and he, he, he was of belief uh, after you work out, get it in 30 minutes and then you don't need it the rest of the day. But that was his belief. I still think you still need to get mm-hmm. it um, just to make sure you get in the right amount of protein for the day. Because The best yeah. way to work out, um, you should be having at least um, two grams of protein per kilo that you have. So if someone's weighing 100 um Sorry, if someone weighs 60 kilos, they should be having at least 120 grams of protein a day is the best way to look at it. So just making sure that you're hitting your protein targets. I go through this um, with the one-on-ones. Your protein is going to be your one number one target to making sure that you're achieving also with everything else. Um, but it's more about just adding things in, not taking anything away. Mm. So with your protein, um, so having that, in, uh, when I was doing this before, uh, my protein was in my main meal um, in the evening. So, and, I, and then I'd just have like, you know, boiled eggs or something for lunch um, and, you know, maybe ham or something. But my main meal was my, was my dinner. So, and that was when I, I would have my, my main protein. So is that sort of how it will work or it's just basically how, how your body you know, sort of how you react to all that or what you what your body needs, I guess, is it? <clears throat> Are you having a protein shake after you work out? No, I have it before my workout, okay. yes. Yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah. Uh, you might be having not enough protein. You might be, what, yeah. what, what I've just... Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. But that's why... I mean, I, I still have... Usually for lunch, I will have what I've had for dinner the night before and I'll have that at work. You know, so I'm sort of still eating, you know, meats and, you know, quite a bit of meat, but yeah. oh, not a lot, but, you know, like enough, I, I think. But, yeah, I mean, I have a protein, one protein shake a day. I don't know if that's... I think for you, you know, I'd almost say, like, another protein shake just to make sure you've got enough, like... Yeah, right. But gathering. But um, I would even go into depth that when we do a one-on-one initial consultation, mm. I would actually be asking you, okay, what are you guys having? These are the questions that I want mm. you guys to be thinking about from now to Saturday. What are you guys having for breakfast, snacks, lunch, dinner, anything that you're eating? Also, whatever you guys are drinking, because that is a massive component, is a lot of people are like, oh, I'm only eating 900 calories, but yet you're drinking another 1,000 calories in coffee, in you know, um, Coke in this and that. So, um, so yeah, just go through all of that stuff in your um, one-on-one. So a lot of these questions um, regarding your nutrition is probably going to be best leaving until your one-on-one. Um, yeah. And I'll help you guys all with that because I can sit there saying to you guys, okay, this is what's going to work. But yes, this is what's going to work for you, but it's not going to work for Brie, it's not going to work for Ben, it's not going to work for D, it's not going to work for, you know, everyone is different and this is where we need to sit down and see what you guys are eating in a day to how we can fix things and how we can achieve your goals that you <coughs> desire. Um, just one more question, sorry. So with 
like with me, I've got a lot of food intolerances. <coughs> yeah. Would that affect the um, the whole plan no. program? That's a really good program. Uh, really good, sorry. Really good question. <laughs> not very good. Um, I am allergic to a lot of things. Um, <laughs> too many things to actually list off. Um, I can actually go through all that kind of stuff with you. Let me know what you're allergic to. And also if it's coming up in recipes and all that kind of stuff. No, yeah. no food intolerances or anything like that is going to affect your results. Uh, yeah. The only thing that's going to affect your results is going to be you not you overeating um you know not listening to it, the advice that we're giving these guys but no food intolerances will not affect anything at all well i've got a long list i'll i'll, I'll bring it with me when i meet you um you know so because stuff like say lettuce for example i can't do lettuce you know <laughs> i can't do <laughs> you know all those top cauliflower apples oranges bats so i'm in exactly the same thing so no yeah through and help you one-on-one -on -one. um yeah. that's totally fine and how you can best look at things um even for yourself i would if you haven't is looking at the fodmap diet yeah okay. what you said before as well jackie there's actually another type of protein you can take called calcium protein and that's when i used to take it when i was bodybuilding at night time and that's slow release so that will prepare your muscles while you're, you're sleeping um mm -hmm. so stuff like that just handy tips like that we can change but cool all right all yeah. right i was gonna ask um so this is gonna start not next week but the following week yep Good. so then uh we're gonna meet with you one on before that week starts yep so once you guys have decided whether you know you guys want to do it i will then look at booking you guys in for your first initial consultation with myself um it's going to be looking at between the wednesday and the saturday because we don't want to go too far out because a lot of people go oh oh well i've done you know my measurements i don't need to watch what i'm eating i'll eat whatever i want and the diet starts on monday so that's why we like to get it around your seminar uh around the seminar and then it will them around the kickoff date sorry and then we'll go through then so so generally i'll be getting these guys in between wednesday and even saturday um before before it all and ben just asked a quick oh sorry had that how was that for you that was good i was uh yeah just wanting to know um the one-on-ones and then you did you mention that there was going to be a kickoff seminar before it starts so that's on the next saturday the, the Saturday, next Saturday no, is the day that it all kicks off as well because the only people that are going to be in the seminar are going to be the people that I've actually joined um, oh, okay. but that seminar is about um, is more just the people that have joined just to give them ideas of what we're going to go through and how to look at your goal setting and all that kind of stuff do you guys want us to mention it a bit more in class as well yeah well, you do you want more people? Do you think you have to? You know, you don't want to overdo it as well. We we put it. We've got a limit number, so we'll just look at see see how many people. But we we want to put a limit because we've opened this as well to people outside. So even if someone's over east, they can do it. But it's okay. pretty much quite of infused. Yeah, yeah, any anyone can yeah. do it, whether you're a member or not member. It doesn't have to be someone mm. that's done class. If you know someone that needs a little bit of extra help, feel free to um, let them contact myself or even Gaz and we can get them um, the information that they need as well. Yeah. It's called my husband, but he FIFO, so he doesn't have a choice what he gets to eat. Well, That's a problem for him. Mm. Yeah. He, mo he moans so much about the food lately. They, it is, it's ridiculous. They, yeah. yeah. Any, any, yeah, okay. Yeah, that's a, a oh, conversation yeah. for a different day. Yeah. <laughs> ben asked, just asked a question, just clarifying if, the, if you're away for a seminar, we'll definitely have it in the group and you guys be able to watch it because we want you to really want you to watch the seminars. They're going to be really handy and helpful. Um, build those good habits. Um, if I'll ask if there's any more questions in a second. So I've, I've created something on Waterfly so you can sign up to the challenge. I'll post the link 
and it's kind of straightforward. You just got to select it, keep going, and it'll ask you if you want to do weekly, fortnightly, monthly, um, and just align it with what day you normally pay. So it's pretty much you guys can sign up yourself. So if you need a hand, let us know. Um, we're going to put flyers around the gym and something I learned not long ago, the QR code, you get your phone out and you pretend to take a picture. And I think you take a picture. Do you take a picture of it? No, you oh, don't. You don't have it. You just have it in front. You just have it in front and it actually brings up the link and it takes you to the, to the sign up. So... Um, I'm sure the coach should help you out. Yeah, so we decided to do a QR, so then there's no one's information placed around the gym. So, you know, um, yeah. that's going to be the best way. It goes straight through to Gaz, um, the information, and then we will then book you on your um, initial consultation and go from there. Um, it just also means that, you know, if you want to take a photo of the flyer and send it to anyone you can, and then they can just use the QR code to, to you know, register is that something that they wanting to do? Yep. No, nope. no yep. one has to be in this gym to be able to get this challenge. Um, we're wanting to look at helping as many people as we can. It's not, you know, just to yeah. us, to the infused people. It's literally anyone that wants that help, um, we're willing to help them. Yeah, it's something we, we've been looking at long time and it's just something we've never really had in the box is nutrition. And we want to follow the baseline. I like have a baseline in the box and this is just a perfect program. Um, you know, you guys are training hard and we want you to yeah, maximise your results. And having a coach there helping you, you guys know what happened to CrossFit, having a coach, having a nutrition coach is going to be just beneficial. So, yeah, just, you know, Baker's super passionate about it. I'm passionate about seeing these guys your first uh, results so that's the reason we're bringing hsn on board so almost like the level method to a certain degree yeah any more questions any more questions any questions you guys that are <laughs> muted <laughs> If there's no questions, we're going to look at um, wrapping this up. Um, if you guys feel free, I have a question, you know, that you decide tomorrow that you um, haven't quite forgot that you wanted to answer it, feel free to come up to Gaz or myself or flick us a text and we will be more than happy to answer them. Um, but, yeah, this is the seminar of the the, the challenge done <laughs> yeah thanks for joining guys thanks appreciate for joining, it guys. Uh, bit of it. and yeah i'll post a link with the next well yeah very soon very soon thanks for that see guys. Guys. See ya. Bye. Thanks, guys see ya bye